Welcome to Play Digital Signage Tutorials. In this tutorial, I'll show how to find and add videos to your slides. Let's start by opening a playlist and adding a new slide. I have a couple of ways that I can add a video, but in my first example, I will add a video from my library. Let's open Assets, and let's open the folder Video, and find a video I can add to my slide. When I've added the video to my slide, I can move it around and resize it to fit my canvas. On the right, in Settings, I have my alignment tools. I also have information like file name, size, duration, and resolution. The editor will automatically adjust the duration of the slide to match the duration of the video. I can toggle on Mute. I can toggle on Loop. Loop is especially useful when you have a slide duration that is higher than the duration of the video, and you'd like the video to keep on looping throughout the duration of the slide. Always on top, lets the player know if a video is on top or if the video should be in the background, and the player will optimize accordingly. If I set Always on Top to No, the video will play behind other elements on the slide. If I set Always on Top to Yes, the video will always be on top no matter what elements I've added to this slide. The last option, and the most commonly used, is Background. Background tells the player to play the video as a background and it is the option that consumes the least amount of resources. The last two settings are positioning and resizing pixel by pixel. Let's remove the video again. In case I don't have a video I'd like to use, I might be able to find it in Pixabay. Pixabay is a royalty-free image and video provider. When I open Pixabay, I can browse or search for a video I'd like to add. Here I'll find a dropdown where I can pick the resolution I'd like. Using a video from Pixabay gives me the same options and settings as before. Let's remove the video again. I can also choose to play videos from sources like YouTube and Vimeo. Let's open up Social in the top menu. And let's try YouTube. The plugin lets me move and resize the video. The video URL is the URL found on YouTube. Copy the URL and paste it here. I can toggle on Repeat Video, Show Video Controls, mute, and if the video has captions, I can choose them in the drop-down. I can choose if the video should start from the beginning or perhaps at a specific time. And finally, I can position and resize the video pixel by pixel. Vimeo is not much different from YouTube. Just like YouTube, I'll have to copy the URL from Vimeo and paste it here. Then I have an option where I can pick a preferred quality. I can toggle on Mute, Loop, and Show Video Controls. I can start the video at a specific time, and I can add captions to the video. Please check our Vimeo support page for more information on captions. That was all for today. Thanks for watching.